In this video, I will show you how to right click in here and get a list of track templates that you can quickly insert and get started right away. For example, I want to insert a piano. So I'll just click that and I get my piano. Now I want a synthesizer. That's just super quick, super easy, and just nice to have your go-to templates, track templates in here. Now, how do you do that? You go to extensions. You need the SWS extension, by the way. Go to resources, and then in here, you're gonna create a slot. So right click, add slot, and then in here, you're gonna double click and load your track template. For example, in this case, I want my string template. I'm gonna open that, and yeah, it's gonna load your template in here. Now, the thing is, like, you can load a shortcut to this. So you're gonna go to the actions menu and search for import slot. 7. So basically you can now use this action to import this track template. Now you can use this however you want. You can even put it in your toolboards, you can even put it as a shortcut in your keyboard or whatever you want. In this case I like to have it on the right click because this way you save a lot of space and it's a window that you can quickly open and close it as you insert. Uh, that's the workflow I like. So how to put it in here? You will go to one of your toolbars and click Customize Toolbar. Then in here, you're gonna go to where it says this menu right here, this drop down menu, Empty TCP Contacts. In here, you can insert whatever action you want. So in this case, let's add action and search Import Slot 7. There you go. Now you can select this and you can place it anywhere you want in the list and you can rename it. So I like to use emojis. So strings, this could be this one and insert string, yeah. And click OK and that should be it. Now you can press OK and now when you right click on it, you will see your action and you can press it to get started playing with your strings. And I should have set this to MIDI. Um, but yeah, there you go. Uh, the cool thing about this is that you can have your go-to track templates in here. And the, the cool thing about track templates is that you can preset any configuration that you want. For example, um, all of these are already set to have this track um, automatic record arm. When, when selected. That way when I click on this, I can start playing right away. And even if I load another synthesizer and I switch to this one, these all have the, the settings that I like. And also my MIDI keyboard attach and all that. This saves time because traditional way is just set a track template, change your input, and then find in the BSD and then name it, and then coloring it, and all these things. This way you save a lot of time. That's it. <laughs> Hope that helps. And, oh, if you don't know what track templates are, I suggest looking up what they are. But basically you can save track as template, right click any or more tracks, save track as template, and you can create track templates. <laughs> um, Hope that's helpful. I'll see you later.